Hello, today we are discussing a MariaDB use case, Intelligent Wolf, with its CTO, Paul Clavet. Hello, Paul. Hi. Hi. So we're going to dive into the reasons they're using MariaDB and the benefits of MariaDB, and also how they decided to become a sponsor of MariaDB Foundation. But let's start off with what exactly is Intelligent Wolf? So Intelligent Wolf is part, it's basically a suite of software that we use for different um, tools. We've got Code Wolf, which we use for re rewrite, which will rewrite software from one um, from one application source to another. So we're good for uh, upgrading legacy software. Our Intelligent Wolf platform is basically um, a framework which we use to build applications for clients, and that actually becomes part of it. We've also got something called WolfServe, which is a drop-in replacement for Apache web server, which is much faster than an um, Apache and much more suited to large workloads and also runs on um, IBM um, power servers as well. Um, so, yeah, so that's really, that's that's the whole thing, really. Cool. And, and what type of uh, users or customers do you have? So we've got um, mainly we're large, large-ish clients. Um, give you an example. One of our clients runs the... Um, probably about half of the railway um, um, railway sort of repairs in the UK. Um, so we've uh, we built a complete system. We completely replaced their old system with a brand new system, which they're using day by day, which is really exciting and uses MariaDB. And we use vector databases for doing that. Our main interest in MariaDB is, in fact, vector databases. Uh, yeah, tell me more. Why, how, so, how, how come, why are you using MariaDB and how did you end so up? So MariaDB is... A lot of it's to do with speed. Um, the MariaDB is about 20% faster than other, other databases we, we tested. And we run a huge game called Wolf Territories Grid. And that, um, obviously, games are much more difficult than business in a lot of ways because you have to have speed. Um, and MariaDB just outperformed everything else. Wow. Uh, vector databases are also really important. Speed is really important with that. Um, and we, we just find also the MariaDB is a really living platform. You know. Um, people at maria are you know it's an exciting there's always new things being developed so we look at the forefront of technology and we feel like other databases kind of sit sitting in the background and not growing and not changing um so yeah streets ahead really cool are there any part you, you mentioned vectors so yeah. is that the main uh, any other features yeah. you're using from MariaDB? um so re really vector vector databases are the main thing um and uh, we have been looking at the object storage side of it as well as actually because MariaDB can talk directly to object storage and that's quite a, we have a massive object storage um set up so that would be quite an interesting thing that we're looking at and the column databases as well um <clears throat> but our main our main interest as a company is we're really into ai we've been into ai for about 4 years but we use ai in a very different way to not to just you know pulling up um, Google Gemini or whatever, and just asking a question, we actually are able to properly interrogate data, like being able to predict where the most likely sites are, where um, where there'll be a rail failure, or you know, being able to ask your two and a half thousand documents that you've got sitting in a in a data silo questions, like you know, um, a, a chartered surveyor, for instance, might say. Um, I'm going to um, I'm going to a site in Watford, which is near where we are, and um, and what should I look out for? And uh, using vector databases, we can say you need to look out for subsidence. They have a lot of Victorian buildings, so they might be collect and then literally it will come back and answer those questions. And we're able to visualize that in 3D as well. And then then that's where Code Wolf came out of that by using MariaDB vector databases. And we use Galera clusters as well, which is another thing. We don't host our, our client. We don't. We tend to build small cluster, server clusters in data centers for our clients with Galera cluster on it because it's just rock solid. And using MaxScale means that, you know, it just manages everything. If one of them goes down, MaxScale just looks after it. We bring them back up, you know, and we've got some quite big um, Galera clusters as well. So that's something as as well. Max scale is fantastic. And, you know, there's just a lot of really good tech there. Awesome to hear. Excellent. So, uh, and and you've also decided to sponsor MariaDB Foundation. So uh, how, do you, how did you arrive at that? Decision? So um, we actually became partners with MariaDB and um, we, we're, just, we're just kind of involved with 
Uh, we want to be involved with MariaDB on a really deep level as it's such a crucial part of our infrastructure and part of our wall stack. And so being being sponsors really gets us into, um, you know, um, I'm, off to, I'm going to be talking to the Brussels day. Uh, you know, it just gets us involved, really, which is Excellent. fantastic. Um, and w- what are your thoughts on open source? Uh, in, in- uh, I think, I mean, basically, this company is running completely on um, Linux. We don't actually have any Windows machines, <laughs> to give you an idea. I think open source is really great. Um, I, I think the fact that you can look at look at code and go, hey, that, that's really good, or even become part of projects. And MariaDB, I like the fact that MariaDB not only provides open source, but the enterprise as well. So you've got the best of both worlds. For someone who comes along and wants to just, you know, run up a quick database and try it out and learn how it works, they can do that right up to a full enterprise, you know, licensed platform with massive support. It's all there, and you know, and you can run vectors on the on the uh, on the open source version. I just think it's really it's really brilliant. It's a really good setup. Awesome, great to hear. So, so rounding this up, are there any final thoughts you would share about uh, your thoughts on MariaDB? Um, I just think if if anyone's out there who's running legacy databases, anyone's out there who's stuck, um, you know, with a really slow old system get hold of companies like us and we can actually migrate you get you onto something new you will you will be amazed at the speed difference and the the delivery and the quality of the the data management that maria db can give it's fantastic awesome great to hear thank you very much paul for sharing all this and all the best 